What's going on, my favorite people in the universe? Welcome back. This is episode 12. Let's get this shit popping. <laughs> All right, so here we go. I'm going to pause it right here. You see that car on the right? Now, remember that car, okay? Because we're at a red light, and we're in the left-only lane. The right side is straight, so you can see where I'm going with this. Now, the light's about to turn green, and the people that are in the left-only lane are doing the right thing. We're making a left turn. So here we go, Super Douche McGee over here. See him? He didn't want to wait in the line. There was quite a few people behind me. I understand that, but don't be a douchebag, because I have a camera. So here we go. We're going to zoom in. Now watch him. He's being all aggressive, and he's tailgating. He's tailgating this... I don't know what the hell he's tailgating up there, but there's a Camaro. Then he does the NASCAR super juke. And he starts riding a Camaro's ass. Then he goes, whoop, douche again, and cuts that guy back off. And I get stuck at a light, but he didn't go very far. Why is he driving like a dick? So this next ridiculousness happens so often in Jersey. I don't even know if I should put it in any future videos, but I'm gonna because, you know, it's how I roll. Now, you watch, I'm waiting for the light to go because it's a delayed green, and there it is. It changed, right? Now, here's one douche who's in the inter intersection. I'll give him a pass, right? But then you got this one, and this one, and that one. Why? Why? There was nobody even behind me. I need to get a rear-facing camera to prove such a statement, but what the hell? So, a few people have mentioned that they want me to do some live commentary as things happen. And I just got lucky enough that I caught two things happening at one time on the live mic. It's not that great. I'm trying to figure out an alternative, but enjoy. They weren't that serious, but, you know, it is what it is. You wanted live, here's live. The fuck are you doing? Fucking blinker, stupid. Ooh, somebody's gonna block this whole intersection. Watch. Yep. Yep. Douche. Fucking douche. So this one's especially douchey and annoying. If you have a nice car, things bother you, especially when it's putting your car in risk. I'm driving normal, and then all of a sudden, look at this cloud. What is that? It looked like freaking pig pen from Peanuts just sprinted across the street. I, I don't understand why that happened and why he had to do that in front of my car. So this next classic douche is just an impatient person and i'll be honest i've seen fist fights break out from road rage from people doing this um not from me i'm a happy-go-lucky guy but if you look to the left there's a giant line of cars i'm going straight this line of cars is going to be making left onto the highway so this person is trying to basically screw the pooch they're trying to just mess everybody up so instead of getting in that gap that's being opened by that nice red car they wait too long they timed it wrong now all of a sudden, I can't even go straight. The people are getting cut off. I'm just like laughing at it because you can't take assholes like that seriously. But the line of cars, you get killed for something like that in Jersey. So here's another example of somebody driving a vehicle that is way beyond their skill level. As you can see, right? What the hell? How wide of a turn do you need to take there, buddy? And he almost knocks my mirror right off the car with his mirror. Like, what is this? A tractor trailer? You couldn't make that turn with your little truck? I, I, I don't understand what the deal was. So this last clip is absolutely one of my biggest pet peeves right next to tailgaters. This is a one-lane road. You need to stop for pedestrians. They are on foot. We are driving automobiles that weigh so much more than them and can kill them. So if you look here, I notice that there's a guy with his kids trying to cross. So my fiance has got her arm out the window to stop the cars. I'm putting my hazards on to let everybody know, hey, we're going to try to let them go. So the one guy that's with them, and there's multiple douches popping up into this one, so you'll see. This guy goes, right? 
and I'm trying to let this guy go. And then I notice this smelly douche McGee right here. He goes by me on the right side, passing. Now, I was going to be going that way anyway. So if you watch this guy, he went around me, even though we had our hand out. And that guy, right? So here goes. That's two douches, right? Keep count. This is amazing. So now I'm letting this guy go. And he's going to be going. He, he knows. I'm a good guy, right? So then a third douche on the right comes out of nowhere and takes the opportunity to just go. Now, they're not even out of the side, the, the street yet. So he's just gotten over with his freaking stupid canoe. Then he's coming, and he almost gets hit by a douche in the gas station. So he keeps going. Then there's another douche there crossing the street. I, I'm just blown away. How many douches can pop up in one small segment of street? And by the way, that canoe is the ugliest color. Go to hell.